Hi and welcome to Becca's Star Collection and welcome to another Slovenian unboxing. Today I have two sets to open. I got the new arrival set and the garden barbecue set. So I got mainly this set because I wanted these figures. Uh, the set themselves are cute but I really wanted these. And uh, this is from the Chantilly Cats family. So this family consists of the mother, baby and father. And you can also get the sister brother and another baby which I do think are older ones uh, I've just searched some on Google and found some on eBay and the one I found on eBay was the sister which is a school camping set and that was pretty pri pricey uh, I saw that the other baby came in a care case and then the brother came in a bedtime set which I didn't find on eBay at all so that might be a rarer set but at least I got this so, so they kind of make out a family, which is nice. So I think I'm going to start with the new arrival set. And you can, you can see all of the pieces it comes with right here. So it comes with the mother, which I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing this, but her name is Miriam. And the baby is Jacquees. Uh, probably totally mispronouncing that, but you can look it up yourself and kind of guess how it pronounced. You can see the right here, all of the sets or all of the pieces. So this set doesn't come with a lot of pieces. Um, it doesn't even have one of those pictures because basically this is all you get. Uh, but yeah, let's open this and see. So here they are, and I will try to see if I can find like a, roughly what I paid for this because I'm not sure. I do think it's a set that comes with one figure and just like a few accessories. I think they, they tend to get pretty pricey, at least here in Sweden. They cost um, usually a bit more than I want to pay. I bought these for my work, so I did get my store discount, but still, uh, sometimes they do get pricey anyway. So let's take a look at the figures first. So this is the mother. She comes with like this classical uh, dress pattern as if, that we have been seeing for a few years now. And it has a bit different coloring. It's a bit more to the orangey color scheme or like peachy than, you know, the standard pink. I do really like the mold of this doll or this figure. I think she looks super cute. And my camera might be a bit dark, so it might be hard to see, but... Yeah, she has this, this interesting face mold right here. And she has this super nice creamy color. And then a little cute tail right here. Of course, here's the baby. And they do come with this little cape. And let's see. This is not a poseable baby. They have this like lying down. Which uh, the babies, I think, I'm not sure if they do now, but uh, the older, or from a few years back, the twin packs usually come with it, babe, this uh, body mold. And their eyes used to be closed, but this one you can see has open eyes, which is nice. It's cute. And I don't want to break it. You can twist the head a bit. Uh, but it's pretty stuck, so I don't want to rip it off. But underneath the cape, it has these normal baby clothes in blue. But yeah, this baby, it looks super cute. I really like this face mold and it just looks adorable. So take, let's take a look at the pieces you get. Let's take a look at the kind of... not sure what this is called. Is it called a bassinet? Uh, it might be, but you can see right here. It's blue. It has this fold-up little uh, top right here, which is super nice. It also comes with this stand piece, so you can make it a riser. Oh, so it wasn't a stand, it makes it into a, I want to say cradle, but that's probably wrong. Um, but you know, one of these. And it comes with bedding, so it does have this mattress right here, so you can put that in first. And this, then just a little cover right here. So let's see if we can put our baby. And of course you can see super cute matching uh, fabric with the white and, no, blue and white polka dots. So let's see if we can snuggle our baby inside. With the cape it kind of looks a bit, um, a bit crowded, but here. So that looks super cute. 
and then it comes with some smaller pieces that are all baby related so you do get a tiny plate with these little cute ears on it and I think this might be the smallest Sylvanian spoon I have so far the normal spoons uh, are small but this one I think take the price so you can see it's yellow and has this little pink top right there so that's cute get one of those you do get a bottle and it's just a normal bottle so you do get these uh, with a single pack I think it's the same bottle nothing special just cute and tiny we do get this little container thing not sure what it's supposed to be but you got one of those and we also got this box with this removable lid which has, says milk so this is kind of like a formula thing I guess so you get one of those so that's the pieces you get in this set so let's take a quick look at those so as you can see it doesn't come with a lot of pieces the main focus here are the figures and I do think this cost between 25 and 28 euros here in Sweden uh, I'm kind of guessing but I know it was over 25 at least uh, to comparison a set of four usually cost around 25 euros here in sweden so uh, you pay do pay a lot just to get this little crib and the extra pieces compared to like what a family with four four figures costs um so you might want to consider that if this is a cheaper set in your country i would totally get it i love this cat family they are super cute but just keep that in mind if you want to look for this it was a pretty bit pricey i think next up is the barbecue or garden barbecue set so you come it comes with the father and his name is Maurice you can see right here and this one comes with those one of those photos with all the sets so you see you get a mu much more pieces here than in the other set but only one figure and I think this this was a bit pricey pricier I think it was 299 crowns which is just under three third three euros that would be awesome uh just under 30 euros uh so 29.99 i do think this costs that much um yeah so let's see what it looks like inside so we do get a lot of smaller packages but let's take a look at the figure first so here is maurice let's compare him to the mother, of course, they are the same same mold. You do have a different clothes, and I do think you can tie off his apron if you want to do that. I would just keep it on because I think it would be a pain to tie it and try to get this uh, as nice of a bow as this one is. But you can take it off if you want to. His tail looks a lot nicer because it hasn't been stuck under his <laughs> under his or a dress. But yeah, I do think this is a nice figures and I I have to be honest, I totally got this set just for the figures. But I will open the other things in the set and give you you all that. So first off, the larger piece, largest pieces comes in three pieces. So it's this table, it is a pole for the, I want to say umbrella, but uh, it's probably called a parasol, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, but as you can see, it's quite colorful. And it do look really nice and do like the decorations or the ornamentation here on the sides and it looks super cute. Uh, I know that they made, I think they made something similar for the seaside, seaside line, uh, but I don't have that so I'm not going to talk too much about that even if I mention it. So here's our first piece, quite colorful actually, uh, with the pink and the yellow with the blue. And it looks cute. So here's the grill uh, or barbecue set. I'm not sure what this is called in English. Here in Sweden we call it grill. And I kind of want to make some kind of English, Swinglish pronunciation of that. But uh, it's the thing for the barbecue. And it has this green color and some wooden pieces here. And it does look like it has some kind of hanging hook for some uh, tools for this and it looks really nice i do have another one uh, another barbecue set 
that came with the car picnic set. I'm not sure if you want to know what it is, so I might leave the name somewhere so you can check it out. Uh, but this one looks more detailed, a bit more, it's a bit more delicate if you know what I mean. Um, but yeah, and with the other colorful pieces in this set, this is a quite a bright set actually. I think I'm gonna leave this in the background so you can compare it to all the things I opened. And basically I have no room on my table for it. So I'm just putting it back. We do get two shares in this set. So it's two fold up shares. So here it is fold up. You can see again bright colors. Uh, which is quite interested, interesting compared to the Sylvania line. I think most of the furniture are kind of a muter color. And not as pastel or in your face. Uh, which makes it kind of interesting. And here it is folded up up so let's see just pull back the back and then you know twist this up and you're done so they're easy and actually kind of nice to store if you don't want to put it up it doesn't take that much space so i do get this bag filled with tiny accessories so i will open that too hopefully not lose anything so this seems to be a set for four people with four plates four cups and four of these I want to say kebab sticks, but um, that's probably wrong too, like barbecue sticks things. So it seems to be some some onion. I want to say this is tomato, but it doesn't look like a tomato. And this one kind of looked like a sausage on the top. So I will just prepare and I'll just put them here on the grill so you kind of can see them in the background. Doing this a bit different than most of my unboxings, but... It looks cute in the background, so I'll just keep it there. As I said, we do get some plates. And they are normal white plates. They look like this. We get four of them. You kind of can stack them like that. And we just put them right there. We also get this uh, serving plate, I think. Which is the same color as the grill. Uh, and yeah. Yes, normal plates. We also get some barbecue uh utensil is that what it's called like cooking things so we can put one there and we do have these two like poking things that we will just put here you kind of can see them and this set actually looks cute when you put it together um sure it looks cute on the picture but i basically <laughs> looked at the figure and like yeah i'm gonna get this don't really care what kind of things this set comes with i just want the figure so, I mean, I, I put a lot of effort and time and consideration into the things I buy. So, yeah, this is super well planned. We get some random foods. Uh, we do get a, a fish. If you want to barbecue that. So, we just put it right here. We also get this corn thing. Right here. So, and we also get this... Bread, which kind of looks like a burger, but doesn't come with a burger. It came, comes with two tomatoes and some lettuce. Oops. If you kind of want to make a salad burger or something. So we just put them right there. We also get some drinking things. We do get this container right here with, you, whoops, with some uh, juice or maybe some lemonade. Um... Some yellow drink thing so we just put it right there we also get four of these cups right here so let's see if we can take them out of this little plastic thing they're usually quite easy to take off so that isn't a problem oops so we get four of those so I put them right here let's see if there's some room on our table and we also get two of these which are drinks and uh, so it's the same color as the one in the container but this one you can actually put in your cup so it looks like there's some drinks in your cup right here so that's actually super cute i know to do that for some of these sets so put them right there so and that's the whole set so i put all of the things together again so you can see it so here it is all together and I do think uh, together it looks really nice. I really like the barbecue uh, set, which 
uh, I didn't think I would. I wasn't that impressed with it when I saw it on the box, but it looks nice. And I do think like the barbecue set gives you more value for your money uh, than with just the new arrival set. Um, if you're looking to pay 30 euro f euros for the barbecue set, I'm not sure if it's worth it, worth it if you're looking to spend 27 pounds or, or euros on the new arrival set. Not sure if it's worth it. Getting it on sale, totally worth it. I really wanted it because of of the figures, as I probably mentioned like a million times in this video, and I do get my store discount. And basically, it's hard for me to find sets in Sweden that I don't already own, so that might have been a contributing factor. But overall, if I kind of ignore how much they cost originally, uh, I do, I'm really happy with them. I like these figures. I do think the barbecue set is super cute. I really like this baby. It's really cute. And I do like um, the bed compared to like uh, the normal cribs because I do have a few of those and this is kind of like a bit more special and makes it a bit different which makes it fun to own. And you do get some cute accessories which would look nice in a nursery. So I do like this set, don't get me wrong, I love it. Bit pricey but nice. Uh, which kind of can sum up most of the Slovenian sets. They do get a bit pricey, but I do love them. So let me know if you have this set or what you think, and let me know if you have the the other fam or the other figures in this family and how you got them and such. I would be super interested in finding out. And yeah, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. Bye.